guys, Mike here. Uh, so today, the fly, I'm going to show you how to tie is one from uh, Fly Tire Magazine. Uh, let's look at it. I think this is the Autumn Edition. They did a whole uh, thing about um, fan-winged flies. And so the one I'm going to tie here is called the, this one here, well, best I can, uh, it's called the uh, Cow Dung Fan Wing. And so, let's give it a try. So I've been trying to uh, just tie new flies that are coming up, trying to get some new patterns, trying to move away from some of the older stuff that I've been tying. And uh, oh yeah, this is a uh, the thread. This is a size 12 hook, and the thread is uh, UTC 70 dark brown ultra thread. And then just kind of tie that on. Come here, snip that away. Where's my good scissors. At? Okay. And so for the uh, for the wings, these are two um, two uh, feathers from a pheasant skin, and uh, so th like this is the skin right here. I don't know it's not in focus, but like up here near the neck, it's just these little feathers right there, uh, right right there. So okay, and so I'm gonna go ahead and just take these and just pinch the tips and strip everything off of them all the way down so that all you have left is just that right there and with both feathers cool and make sure they're pretty much kind of even and these are okay and then I'm gonna oppose them And there's a couple different types of there's a couple different ways to attach these. Um, some people like to actually hold them over the stem or the hook shank. There you go. Once you got them like that, perfect. And then just make a couple tight turns, and then lift them up. work. Got a couple fibers right in the middle sticking up. I'm just going to come in with my scissors and all the way down. There we go. And then come in and trim that off. And I'm just going to do one little figure eight just to hold them down in place. <laughs> Cole's got his bone. Okay. Come on, way back. Now this is just a, uh, a ginger uh, hackle, fi uh, hackle feather. Uh, this is a really large one, so I I'd use them just for tail fibers. And come in, get a good pinch of a uh, of a uh, hackle fibers, <clears throat> and then just kind of come in here, and measure this out real quick. Okay, and then come in with a little loose, and tighten it up. That's perfect. That's what you're looking for. I didn't even have to trim them. Look at that. That's skill. Okay. And then uh, for the dubbing, I'm going to use. Um, it says use a dark olive, and which I have, but I'm going to kind of go off of a little bit, and uh, I'm going to make this one right here like a bright green. Uh, no, let's, let's stick with tradition. This is a uh, kind of a sparkle dub, just a little bit. A little bit of ice in it. Give this flower a little bit more bling. I didn't like that. There we go. That should work. Perfect. That got a little too bulky for me. I'll just strip off the end of the excess. Okay. Cool. 
And then for the hackle, I'm going to use, uh, let me get out. Where's that cape at? Here it is. Okay. This is a, uh, this is a whiting high and dry. And this is a uh, ginger. Yeah, this is ginger is also. And uh, go ahead and pick out a feather that I like. Nope. Got to go a little bit bigger. I really need to get another another saddle soon, or another cape and ginger. Because I've used up, I've used up almost all the uh, all of the. Uh, uh, size 12 and 14 and 16 feathers in this cape so it's getting about that time I'm just gonna tie it on and the way I like to tie it on with these right here I just kind of lay the feather right in the middle between the two wings and then bring them back and then there we go perfect and I didn't give myself enough space to work with there we go Start wrapping. Hold on. This is not the best feather to use, but it works. You just kind of throw in a quick half hitch and make life easy on me. I usually don't like using hackle pliers if I can avoid it. And then once you got that tied off, go ahead and bring your thread up real quick and pull everything back just to kind of expose the head and form your head come here and just whip finish that real quick Cole calm down he's got that bone over there and he's just going to town okay there we go yeah. And don't worry, these the, these pheasant fibers they're they're like almost like soft tackles, but so every now and again, see I have, I have my hackles kind of I got hackle fiber that's stuck between my wing right there. There we go, that's perfect right there. But yeah, that's it. That is the cow dun dung cow dung fan wing dry fly. So beautiful looking fly. Like a ride, son. So I sitting down in the front seat, I turned on the radio.